bats, mother bats, will have a new home inside this bat condo soon at Erlin Recreation Area. This is the Taj Mahal of bat structures in, uh, at least in, in Northwest Ohio here, right? Fully waterproofed, sealed, complete with a 35 year roof on the top, treated lumber, all for the safety of 6,000 plus bats that will eventually call this bat condo home in two years. You're looking at a bat condo that can hold 6,000 mother bats and they're young. Tucked away in the corner of Erlin Recreation Area on 80 acres along the northeast edge of Hancock County. It's one of 16 parks in the Hancock Park District. The peak is 22 feet in the air. The bottom of it there is right at about 12. Volunteer Brandon Burrow built the condo with an $11,000 sustainability grant from Marathon Petroleum. There's actually holes in the side of the uh, soffit there that they can enter and exit through. They come in and out of the sides there and it gives them an opportunity to kind of swoop down and then get into this tree area, which was very specific to help uh, keep them from being attacked by predators. Dan Pavic, professor and biologist with Bowling Green State University, explains why a healthy bat population is so important to our ecosystem. Most bats eat insects, so 70% of all world species of bats feed on insects. And many of those insects are pests. They're things like mosquitoes and moths that, of course, mosquitoes are a problem because they vector different disease organisms. Moths oftentimes are as caterpillars feeding on trees, fruit crops, vegetables, field crops. So bats do a large amount of pest control. Burrow explains what happens inside the condo once the bats arrive. In this area, there's close to 400 three quarter inch voids and that's where the bats go in and roost. So every single gap you see in there, we built very intentionally so the bats can climb in, sleep, stay close together, huddle warmth. And then when you look at the structure from the outside, all those boards actually go all the way up into the peak. In Hancock County, J.D. Pooley, 13 Action News.